Gold medalist over 5,000 metres there. Switzerland, Manuela Shah. Won European Championship gold 2014 over 4, 8, 1,500 and 5,000 metres. Trisha Keller of Switzerland, her compatriot, will be going as well, along with the Hamadi Kurt. Turkey, Vanilla, Wallagrin, who picked up bronze net 5,000 metres for Sweden. Annika Zayen of Germany. Alexander Helbling, who was fourth in the 5,000 metres. She won silver in the 200 metres final yesterday, though. And Margaret Vandenbroek, who was fourth in the 200 metres, but took silver over 5,000 metres. Manuela Shah, the championship and European record holder. Madison de Rosario of Australia. Back in May of this year, she set the world record in Notville. So away they go. Once they come along over the finishing line for the first time, it will be three laps to go from there. But they'll be working their way around the track trying to get themselves into a position to challenge that lady who's in front Manuela Shah and she's already got out to a 15 meter lead it's a very dangerous thing to do if you're giving a lady of that ability 15 or 20 meters straight away she's not even pushing at the moment and they have 1200 meters to go well she didn't waste time in the 5000 meters and she's not wasting time in the 1500 meters final Manuela Shah looking for a second European title. Remember, she won all four gold medals that she went for in the European Championships in Swansea in 2014. She did not compete in Grosseto at the last Europeans two years ago. She was seventh in the World Championship final last year in London and fourth, agonizingly fourth, in the Paralympic Games in Rio. She's way, way ahead of the rest right now. Good gap back to second place. The Margaret Van der Broek had finished in the silver medal position. Behind Shah in the 5,000 metres final here and fourth in the 200. There's obviously a great array of races available for the T54s. You can't just be a sprinter. You can go up to the marathon. And Manson Rosario is the world record holder in this. Don't forget the Commonwealth Games marathon gold medalist in Gold Coast famously and uh, winning marathons and half marathons again last week. Look at how clear Shah is. Way, way clear of the rest. A big gap back. Looks like Kelly's beginning to make a little move up uh, alongside Bannerbrook with two laps to go. Yeah, how do you answer the uh, what this lady does? Manuela Shah. She just goes out. There's two categories I really have an affection for. It's the T11 and it's this one, the T54. Because as you said, you can go across so many different categories. It's already become a race to see who can pick up the silver and bronze medal because Manuela Shah is well out in front. She's about 70 metres out in front by herself and trailing back the whole remainder of the bunch. Five of them back there really doing their best to try and keep up and they cannot do it. Manuela Shah, she'll come down, she'll take the bell and by that point she'll be around 90 to 100 metres ahead. The question is, who's going to get there? Vandenbroek is currently in second position in that bunching group as they'll head down in about 100 metres time to take the bell. But it's Manuela Shah who, with around 350 metres to go, is going to absolutely blitz this one. The only question is going to be is can she break her own championship and European record as the rest of the athletes go across the line? Well, Manuela Shah leads by about a third of a lap right now, and Kurtz who won the 200 metres of the T53 on the outside with Vandenbroek. That's the main race at the moment because Manuela Shah has won this. She's got the gold hanging round her neck now. I wonder if she wants to go through the entire set again and win all the gold medals that are available to her. One final turn for Manuela Shah, and she's on the way to victory. Kelly's trying to make it a one-two. Helpling has made a very good move as well up. Way out of your picture at the moment. Shah is going to win this, and it's going to be a championship record by a long way. She's going to break it by 22 seconds. 333.40, a second gold for Manuela Shah. But now the big race is for the silver, and they are going to take this. Helbling is in for Switzerland to take the silver, and bronze goes to Vandenbroek of the Netherlands with Wallengren fourth for Sweden.
But what a champion. Manuela Shah truly is. 333.42, the new championship record. And she won it at a canter. A class above the rest of Europe. And you know she won't be satisfied with two goals. Helbling pushing up very well. And Vandenbroek, who finished in second place in the 5,000 metres final and fourth in the 200, now picks up the bronze here. Absolutely marvellous, yet again. You expect nothing less from one Wallachar. Switzerland, one of the prime wheelchair racing nations. You have to love the T54 racing. It is pure out and out racing. Exactly 15 seconds of a margin. Shah gold to Helbling silver. And Vandenbroek mopping up the bronze. Wallengren in fourth position to add to a bronze in the 5,000 meters. So remember the last European, she won four medals, three silvers and a bronze. Well, she's got one bronze so far. Helbling well clear with silver in the 200 meters and silver in the 1500. You don't get that on the IAAF second, but you don't get the likes of Manuel Shah in that either. Swiss one to them. Shah, Helbling, and the Dutch take the bronze. Vandenbroek in third place.